June 3rd. Fasting puts God first. In the Old Testament, the Hebrew word for fast is sum. It means to cover. Over the mouth. In the New Testament, the Greek word is nestuo, meaning to abstain from food. Remember, a fast is a conscious, intentional decision to abstain for a time from the pleasure of eating in order to gain vital spiritual benefits. What does true fasting include? Today, let's look at two aspects of this practice. First, a fast is a time set apart to seek God's face. You abstain from things you enjoy in order to give your whole heart to Him in prayer. Fasting tells God, My prayers and the answers I'm seeking are more important than my pleasure in eating. Second, a fast puts God first, it focuses all attention on Him. Not on His gifts or blessings, but on God Himself. It shows Him how much you love and appreciate Him. In this way, a fast brings intimacy with God. God reveals Himself only to people who want to know Him. He says, You will seek me and find me when you seek me with all your heart. Jeremiah 29:13. A fast is a purposeful commitment to God. If you tell him, Lord, I want to see your face, but your mind wanders, he will say, I cannot show you my face when you're not looking at me. Fasting is not a matter of trying to get something from God, it's a matter of trying to get to God. When you find God himself, you will discover that everything you need comes with him. Prayer, Father, I desire to put you first in my life. Help me to understand the role of fasting in my pursuit of you. In Jesus' name, Amen. Thought, Fasting brings intimacy with God. Reading, 2 Chronicles 19-20, John 13-21-38.